good one. You can coin that, but yeah, we're out here. Uh, I'm here. Skiff's there. Jackal and Leon are right there, so we're going to have a, a good old-fashioned New Jersey team kill here in top 16 winner's semifinals, so we're already here in top eight territory between the number one and number four seeds today, so. Hey, man, I mean, you know what? Eventually, at some point, New Jersey's got a team kill. It's just going to happen, man. There's so much talent just within that state alone and that fusion. A lot of them are here just trying to get their best gameplay going. But right now, man, Jackal trying to get some good percentage here. But Leon off to a better start at the moment. Yeah, I mean, these two definitely tend to go back and forth a lot. Uh, Jackal, I believe, is upset-wise on Leon. But I believe Leon won the last time these guys played, which I believe was at uh, Momentus. So, uh, could be wrong. Nonetheless, though. Uh, Leon having a very close uh, set earlier against Jack, another uh, oh. wolf main, and there we go. Not going to be able to tech the Nair uh, from the ledge right there, and Jackal gets out to an early start here, Skip. Yeah, I actually did watch that set with Jack. I mean, Jack played really well. It's just unfortunately Leon, you know, just did some Leon things, was able to close that out, just played phenomenal the entire way through. But there we go, getting a flying slam. Closing out that first stock here. We're evened up at two stocks apiece already. Hey, listen, at level 16, your Jack evolved into a Jackal, so... <laughs> uh, everybody, uh, take notes. Nonetheless, though, again, and Leon... What, level 36, Jack Steptikyla. <laughs> no, he's, he's a jacket. There we go. Jacket. All right, all right. <laughs> Nonetheless, though, we are uh, even up here. Leon going to get this grab and a forwarder for his troubles. Again, a really strong combo for Bowser, but Jackal answering back with some percent of his own. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, it's definitely been a, a slobber knocker between these two. These two are definitely putting on some big moves. Oh, wow, wasn't able to get the flamethrower, actually. That was a little unfortunate, but maybe he can get a second chance here. Wow, actually, we'll find the forward tilt angle that down. Send them straight to the blast zone. Leon to take it a good lead here. Going to get some good extra percentage. 227. Yeah. yeah, Bowser's F tilt, super active, and that move lingers, hitbox lingers for so long. It can really make it hell for characters with very linear recoveries. But Jackal, mm -hmm. continue to answer back here, but now, oh, oh no. Yeah, the problem here is that now that you know Bowser just continues to get more and more uh, rage just built up here. That backer not gonna be able to do it from across PS2, but trying to get a forward tilt scares him into recovering just a little too low as Leon takes that game one with a nice two stock to go with it. Yeah, listen, there just becomes stretches in this matchup where you kind of hit those points of no return and the lead definitely starts to snowball away from you. Jack is against Bowser especially. Um, the lead can snowball very, very hard, you know, not in your favor, as you saw Leon open up, uh, you know, but was once a close game turned into a two stock at the end of the day. So Jackal, again, we do best of threes all night here at Fusion. So, uh, you know, Jackal's gonna have to win this one to keep his winner's bracket uh, hopes alive here. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's gonna be a tough one going right back to PS2, especially with what oh. we just saw from Leon. Oh man, that could have been absolutely devastating, but Jack, we're gonna find their way back to the ledge one way or another, but the back throw from Leon, this is just unfortunate, man. Jackal just continues to find himself in disadvantage over and over again. Yeah, and he's not doing anything flashy as Leon. It's really meat and potatoes edge guarding with flame breath and, you know, F tilt, a little bit of down tilt here, and the massive hitbox of that fair is gonna catch Jackal jumping, so Leon, Gets off to a huge uh, start here uh, in game two, Skip. Yeah, that was actually really, really good. I mean, it only took like, what, 37, I think, to start off there. I mean, now that after Jackal respawned, I mean, he's able to get some good percentage here. 1.9 extra credit, you know, it's, I guess it's something. It's not the best scenario, but <laughs> gonna get that flying slam for about 23 more. I'm gonna see if Leon can keep this pressure going. So far, so good, wow. Teacher, teacher's grading on a curve, Skip. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Dude, Okay, still found a way to take the stock, but that was, I don't know if that was like intentional, but that could have been sick. I got crossed up in my chair. That was shades <laughs> of shades of Jason Williams in the mid 2000s, my goodness. Yeah. All right, well, we're gonna see that down air, just get a little bit of damage, but Jack was gonna find that forward tilt as well. Looks like they're starting to take their time a little bit more, which they can afford to, man. Wolf's got a plethora of different play styles. We'll find that back there, won't be able to close it out. Bowser, again, the heaviest character in the game. We'll be able to survive that one, but not that one there. Gonna be able to close out that stock, and now Jackal's got a nice little lead. Oh! Wow, yeah, if that, if that combo hit any other character, it would've exploded, and now Jackal, despite, you know, uh, being down early, now finds themselves back in a solid position here. Oh, okay, he's gonna be able to find his way back, but that spike could have been the game with the flying slam right there. Wow, was that just bad DI or was it because of the platform? I think it's definitely because of the platform. That move is really, okay. really strong, and Bowser has enough rage built up on him to where that probably was gonna kill. And now Leon only a couple of hits away from evening things back up, and 
There we go, Jackal trying to be careful with that Nair space facing, but oh. Leon there to greet him. Yeah, 53% right off the bat, man. Right off that forward throw, or excuse me, up throw, and just built up damage from there. This is gonna get really scary. The up smash won't be enough to close it out there. Leon will find their way back to the stage. But one back here, 150% now for Leon. Gets that Nair, is that gonna be it? Yes, it will be as he finds the spike to stay alive in winners. Yeah, listen, once Bowser is forced to recover from that low skip, you know, you're, like most, you know, characters only your recoveries, if we take a look at the last stock here, you know, uh, Leon forced to recover low, Jackal there to trade with the Nair, and uh, the, you know, the down air to finish it up. You know, Wolf's Nair, it's been said time and time again, that move is so good at like every asset of the game. It carries really well in the low percent, it's a great combo center mid percent, and it's a great killing and edge guarding tool at the high percent. So, Jackal showcasing uh, all of the move, all of uh, Wolf's Nair's, you know, usability, but still has to win one more game here to advance in the winner's final. Yeah, that Nair one is easily a better character than half the roster uh, yeah. in this game, it feels like sometimes. Right up there with Snake Up Till. But uh, as we move forward here, uh, we got Leon starting off hot once again, but Jackal starting to answer back for 56, trying to go for the down smash there, potentially trying to take that stock. But here we go, man. Using that Nair once again, kind of like how you pointed out. Yeah, no, it's huge. And it's definitely, I'm, I'm sure Wolf's, you know, best approach to not getting upbeat out of shield because he's able to fade uh, in and out of space with it so well. But mm -hmm. Leon, once again, uh, setting up a low recovery from Jackal, but he was able to get around to it and now has uh, Bowser in disadvantage. Uh, both players trading spaces very uh, eloquently. What a great empty hop into the flying slam. Actually able to close out that stock. I mean, and Jackal almost closed out the stock earlier too, but Leon actually delayed the recovery just a little bit. Actually recovered from like, I think the absolute lowest point Bowser could probably go to. But yeah, wow, that was just a huge stock there. We're gonna see if Jackal can find a way to answer back. And you kind of need to because again, Leon's one of the best players in the world. You don't want to give him a single bit of space to just continue a lead if you don't have to. Yeah, and again, Jackal uh, is hitting all the right buttons here, but Bowser, such a big body, refusing to die right there that uh, the up tilt will get the job done. And thankfully for Jackal, only, you know, 36% on his tab right now, so definitely still within arm's reach for both players. For sure, for sure. Okay, there we go. Another flying slam going to land right on that platform at 59%. Look for the four tilt, trying to get Wolf into a really bad spot off stage, but another flying slam, man. I mean, Jackal's got to be a little more elusive because I feel like Leon's just getting that whenever they want. Yeah, it's hard, you know. Ooh, but here we go. A nice little change from Jackal, the double fair to the back air. That's gonna be big damage. Bowser without a jump, uh, but missing the, uh, the edge guard right there. Mm -hmm. Ooh, wow, weird interaction there on the forward tilt. Oh, you know, I would have liked to see a side beat just for the hell of it, but oh, we're gonna find the spike anyway. We'll still be able to take the stock. Beautiful stuff from Jackal, and now they are one stock away from moving on in bracket here. Yeah, definitely uh, doing very, very well right now. Ooh. Get into those low percent wolf strings. The down smash will catch. Not going to be enough to kill just yet, but Leon. Whoa. Yep, forced to, yep, forced to recover low. And Jackal there to greet him with the claws as uh, the space mercenary himself, Wolf O'Donnell, mm -hmm. and Jackal will be moving on into winner's finals. Yeah, man, look at that. That down smash is not going to be enough, but is already ready for the pretty linear recovery from Bowser getting a huge down here to close out the set. Game, set, and match for Jackal, man. What a... Whew. That was a hot set. Yeah, no pun intended, because a lot of fire was uh, using that uh, <laughs> set. But yeah, listen, that's kind of the... <laughs> I'm here all week, try to feel. But... Um...